Hurry up, shit is out. I don't know why. My Facebook always act like that. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, 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 yeah. This can't be possibly be one person on here. It can't be. I might as well went and did a YouTube live. And maybe people out here getting ready for Christmas, getting lied to once again. See the title, right? Purse was good. Percy, 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 Mercy, Mercy, Percy. You know what Facebook been doing, Percy? Facebook have not been letting people get their notifications, man. So I want everybody to share this out. You see, I got on here police officer, judges, and attorneys. Let me say this one more time. I'm not gonna cut them, but I'm gonna let y'all see. You see the title, right? Peep the title. So if you know an attorney, you know the FOP, you know any judges, please share this out to them. On my um, Patreon, I'm going to be going into in-depth classes, in-depth classes on my Patreon, y'all, but I want y'all to share this out because I don't want them to jump on here and, um, say, oh, we didn't know, oh, I will challenge them, maybe they probably in the courtrooms robbing somebody right now, maybe the attorneys are ripping somebody off in the courtrooms at this moment, let me see what time it is, they're probably having... They probably having if they're on the East Coast, they probably having lunch or dinner with the with the DA. With the DA. And maybe the judge. So while we wait, I want everybody to do me a favor. While we wait, I want everybody to go pick up the calendar. And don't forget to join the Patreon. This is where I'm going to have the in-depth classes at. So please sign up for Patreon. Just go to patreon.com. Look for the Severe Bay Show. Sign up there. Okay? Sign up for Patreon. Do your part, people. If you want to, you can hit the Cash App also, Sabir Bay Cash App, and Sabir Bay Radio at gmail.com. Support. This is the calendar. You can purchase the calendar by hitting me up at request info at the Sabir Bay Show.com. I know it's the holiday, I know y'all gonna spend your money on Christmas. A lie, once again. <laughs> okay. These are my photos, okay? Not Photoshop. Sabira's photos. This is Sabira's photos from the calendar. So don't ask for too much on here. 
sign up for the Patreon. Also, you can get the calendar. All right, 2019. It's just really a collector's item, people. It's just a collector's item. What's up, Dave? So hit the Patreon, cause this is oh, this is the only place where I'm gonna go in debt classes with. Please don't expect me to do that on here. If you want to sign up, subscribe, be a member for the Sabir Bay Show Patreon. But if you choose to, which people really don't go to because I say the Cash App or PayPal, they really don't go to the Cash App or PayPal. So this is why Patreon is being set up. Because people get on here just to get on here to see what I'm talking about and steal all your damn content and regurgitate or repair it what you just said. Percy was good. People. Let me share something with y'all. This takes a lot of work to do. I don't go to Wikipedia. Let me make this clear with y'all. I don't go to Wikipedia like these other dudes. I don't cut and paste from Wikipedia. Everything that I do is researchable. This is why the title is called Critical Thinking in Debates. Critical Thinking in Debates. This is why I have, I want you to go right now to, if you know somebody that's a judge, that's an attorney, and believe me, they watch anyway, but I'm said I'm gonna call them out since we love to call each other out. We love to call each other out and debate with each other. We love to go back and forth with each other, but the one group that they don't call out is those people. You don't never hear them dudes calling these cats out, do y'all? Yes, it takes finances like a mother freaker. No doubt. They think it's just falling from the trees. No. Attorneys go and rip you off every day. And they the ones that tell you. Let me see how I'm going to work this critical thinking, y'all. Are y'all ready? Could you everybody share this out? Share it out. There's always rules, man. Look at these rules. Hold it. Before I do this, these rules is dope. You see that rule? Y'all know that man right there, right? Look at those rules. Be clean both sides, in, in, inside and out. Need to look up to the rich, nor down at the poor. Oh, I love these quotes. Do y'all see this? I want this to marinate on y'all. Marinate. But while we doing that, please share this out to all those groups to love to debate with each other and argue with each other. It makes exposed videos, but you haven't made no exposed videos to none of these Europeans. You made no exposed video to not near politician. You never, none of these so-called black groups are challenging not a politician, not a judge, not an attorney, none of them. So please, here's the eight rules, right? This is the eight rules. I'm here to challenge the judges, the attorneys, the police officers, and I know y'all watching. You're a violation of the Constitution and everything else and with our people. So those are the eight rules. Here's your 10 rules. Focus, improve yourself, don't chase money. Don't that sound like that right there? Need to look up to the rich nor down at the poor. Don't chase money. Be comfortable with anything. Laugh at everything. Know that you can. Provide value. Life without fear. Hold up. Life without fear. Let me show y'all something. Wait a minute. Be genuine. Don't cheat. Be too brave to lie. You see that? Be too brave to lie. This is what your judges are doing, your attorneys are doing, all of them are doing this. You see that? Live life without fear. I don't give a goddamn if you're a police officer. If your partner's doing something wrong, live without fear. Deal with the consequences. Do y'all know they have this thing called? 
hope y'all sharing this stuff, because I know they watching. How you doing, police officer? How you doing, attorney? How you doing, judge? Don't think for the one minute they're not watching this. Do you know that they have a wall, a, a, a blue wall of silence? A blue wall of silence. They tell you don't snitch, but they got a blue wall of silence. Did y'all know that? Could y'all hurry up and go share this out? Listen to me. I won't block them. I want them to join me. This is who we should be debating with. We shouldn't be debating with each other. That's stupid. Debate with the ones mentally. Mentally. Let's debate with them. Okay? But I hope y'all share to the FOP. Share with the FOP. I want to I want to hear their thoughts. And I'm going to show y'all some critical thinking. If y'all don't know what that is, let me bring you over here real quick. They'll talk all that smack when somebody get off here, but they never come on here live. And you have spineless Negroes that know this and ain't going to talk about nothing. Think for yourself, people. So I'm going to show you how they violate the Constitution and violate the state Constitution. Oh, just in case they don't know what that is, that's these things right here. Just in case they don't know, that's what this is. So we're going to have a master class out here in Denver. We're going to have a master class out here in Denver, but it's not going to be live on YouTube or Facebook. It will be live on Patreon. So the only way to get the class, people, is that you have to sign up for Patreon. You have to go to Patreon. That's the only way you're going to get it. The only way you're going to get the live is sign up for Patreon. Okay? And your support is right there. Cash app or PayPal, baby. So, how is it that we got all these... I'm going to show you something the FOP. Y'all, let me share this with y'all. We got so much heart to fight each other and argue with each other. But we won't fight against the people that's oppressing your people. Think about it. We will fight against each other, but won't fight against the ones that's lying to you, but you got black Negroes that go tell you you're gonna vote. You're not thinking clear, people. You're not thinking clear. I'm gonna show y'all some stuff. Remember I told you, critical thinking, and deal with facts. Bear with one second, bear with me. I'm gonna sit this down in front of me. Yes, the FOP. This is this right here, hold up. See, they pay into the union, people. This is the problem with black folks. We don't understand this. They pay into this union. So when anything goes down, they have a spokesperson for them. They have a spokesperson for them when, they're in, when they get in trouble. Why do you think a, a police officer can get disrespect you when government was instituted amongst men? Hmm. Government was instituted amongst men, right? I'll let y'all marinate it. Go get a police officer. Let's ask him that question. But I'm looking for something. Bear with me. Bear with me. One second. Oh, boy, I got these things are kind of old, huh? I want y'all to look at this for a minute. Y'all ready? You see that FOP? You see that hand? You see that eye? You see the five-pointed star? This is an old nationality card. You see the eye? You see the hand? You see the star? The five-pointed star? This is my old nas that's my son's nationality card. He was baby then. I gotta get these things. It really, to me, is irrelevant, but I do have to get it re-laminated. But, you see the hand? Eye? Star? Oh, y'all thought I didn't have none of these things? Oh, y'all be playing. Oh, y'all be playing, G. 
Y'all thought I just walked into this information? Ooh, really? This is Cherokee? You think I just walked into this information? Critical thinking is a mother freaker, y'all. I let people set themselves up. Ooh, I let you set yourself up. This is my son's. This is Amir since he was a baby. Ooh. Peep the FOP symbol. The hand, the eye, the star. Critical thinking, people. Critical thinking. Did y'all see that? Mm, mm, mm. I mean, oh, Bruce just got on here. Bruce, let me show you something. Hey, Bruce, I want you to share this out, and I want you to rip this and put it on YouTube and leave it the exact same way it is. Please, brother, rip this, put it on YouTube, and leave it the exact same way. This is critical thinking and debates with, I called out judges, attorneys, police officers. I want y'all to share this out. But you see the eye, you see the hand, you see the star. You really think they don't know who we are? While we sit up here arguing back and forth and debating with each other on social media? While we sitting and debating, I would love and hopefully Jeff from Jeff Culture Center brings some politicians in. Hopefully he brings some politicians in. He can pull that off. So there's the hand, the eye, the star. It's not a get out of jail card, people. It's actually for the nationality card is for your, you know, your future. Your, that's all. Ain't got nothing to do with getting out of jail. But the FOP card, which is the boys club, but which I told y'all before, you better look up the RICO law. You better look up the RICO law, baby. I don't know if you understand this. This is for these police officers. Every police department is an organization. Every police department. Listen, I keep trying to share this with y'all, man. Please research, pick up law dictionaries. What the police are doing, the parking authority is doing. The parking authority is private. I don't know if y'all know that or not. The parking authority is private. When they take your vehicle and park it on a private lot, that's private. But it's a RICO, it's right, hold up. I can put it out the law dictionary. Everybody should have a law dictionary. I hope I know some attorneys watching this. I'm trying to walk y'all down this line so you can understand what's going on. But again, the in-depth classes will be on here. You got to go to Patreon and sign up, people. I'll keep signing share this with y'all. You have to sign up for this. Patreon. Okay? And don't forget the Cash App. Support people. Because I don't think y'all getting this nowhere else. Alright? So let's go back to the RICO. Corrupt organizations. Who are the most corrupt people? Talk to me for a minute. Attorneys? Are they? Police? Taking your property without due process? Talk to me for a minute. You can look this up. Don't believe... This is not wiki. Title 18, United States Code, 1961. This is what you do. U.S. United States Code, Crimes, Criminal Procedures. Right? This is what you do. This is not wiki, people. Like these guys love to go Wikipedia. Look, look at this. Look at this. You see this? Could everybody go, go to Cash App and give me $15 to Cash App? Could everybody go to Cash App and give me $15? Look at this. Dear readers, they're telling you right here, everyone's reading this, this gave $15, $15 right now as a fundraiser. Ain't this a mother freaking shut your mouth? <laughs> Hold on, we're going to close this out. A picture this. I'm trying to tell you what they hide from y'all, man. But you don't want to go, it's too right to give Sabir that, right? But I bet you these attorneys, if they correct on what they said, they could actually put up some money. 
Ooh. Title 18. Okay? So what do you think they're doing to y'all? When the police take your cars and take your property without due process. Let me sit this down one more. I'm, I'm all right. We don't think critically. You think these people are smart because they went to a university or a college. Then tell them to embarrass Sabir. Tell them to embarrass me on any platform. It's that simple. I always say that. I'm open for the embarrassments. And don't think for one minute they're not digging in my background. They're trying to dig, 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 dig. and trying to find out how the hell do I know this? What school did he go to? I'm just letting y'all know what they're thinking. Hey, Spark. What's up? I know, but the thing is that brother, what we do to each other, brother Bruce, that we will sit on social media. These Negroes wanna be scholars, will argue with one another about the ancient black gods of Egypt, about aliens in the sky, and people will say, yeah, yeah, well he chopped him up. Well, why don't you go chop up the goddamn European on debates? Why don't you chop up the European to have an open dialogue with him? We love to sit up here and argue religion all day long with each other. But well, why don't y'all put up money, shut the hell up and put up money and say, let's get these politicians from the judges to the police. Stop filming people. Stop filming people. Stop filming the injustice. Okay? And this goes to you Moors too that's out here talking this religious dogma. That goes to y'all too. That go for y'all. If you don't like it, so what the hell? Stop talking the dogma. But come correct on what you're saying. And stand on facts and truth. If you're standing on love, truth, peace, freedom, justice, and damn it, stand on it. Stand on it. Stop dealing with dogma. That ain't saving our people. It's not saving our people. And if you upset about me speaking from the heart, that's not severe based problem, that's your problem. You can join me right now. Right now. If, I'm a, if I would challenge a judge, an attorney, and a police officer, then what the hell I would like? You ain't nothing to challenge. Because I know you don't have the heart or the balls to do it. Our people are dying out here. Our people are probably being taken constantly on these streets. When these people take an oath on this, they take an oath. We didn't take an oath on this. They took an oath on this. Yes, a lot are locked up on a RICO law because what happens, the problem is with most people, we calling it organizations. Let me make this clear for all of y'all. Let me make this clear. Sabir Bay belongs to no organization. Sabir Bay belongs to no organization. And make this clear, just in case somebody say he belongs to something. Sabir Bay belongs to no organization. Okay? None. So let me show y'all something. The Constitution. There's two constitutions. It's a state constitution and a U.S. Constitution. Man, that needed to be said real talk. No, it's real rap. No, I'm always going to say this, Brother Hannibal, because people think in this dogma. It ain't got nothing to do with no dogma. It has nothing to do with dogma. This is actually called the Moorish divine, 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 not religious, religious, divine national movement. But people take advantage of that also. That's why they get duped. So I'm opening up. And people say, why are you challenging these attorneys? Because they're the ones who are lying and they're talking as if they know something about law. And these Negroes run behind them as if they know something about law. And they don't. So here's the opportunity to come checkmate me. I play life's chess, not physical chess. I'm learning physical, but not life. Life's chess. Okay? What cities, a cities? What is a city charter? A city charter is coming, it's actually a municipality. It actually deals with the rules of a police department in the city, the city council member, the fire department. You can go by that. Let me see how easy this is. Y'all asking me this, but please support. Please support, hit the cash app or go in 
and sign up for the Patreon because the classes are going to be in depth. So every city has a charter. If you attorney, I know you sitting here watching. Well, brother, that ain't going to work in the court. Well, we ain't in court right now. We're not in court. And it would work in court if y'all was telling the truth about what kind of courtrooms we in. We in legislative created courts. Let me say this again. Legislative created courts. Let me say this again. Legislative created courts. They're not constitutional courts. This is a charter. Cities, populations. That's a charter. I go to work religiously, I pump gas. <laughs> that's what's up. So that's a home rule charter. Every city operates under this. Every. Every city operates under this. We need to go back to those Article Three courts. See, this is the problem, though, Brother Bruce. They do. They will say it's an Article Three court, but see, the catch is: you ready for the catch? There's two types of Article Three courts. Two types, and this is why we have to have master classes set up. I know you attorneys are watching this. I mean, you turnovers are watching. That's the Latin term. Attorney means to turn or to transfer over, to turn over, a turn, to transfer over. Prove me wrong, attorneys. And I know y'all watching. You're air hustling like a mother freaker. But I will bring you in. Let me say this again. I will bring on any attorney, any judge, any police officer. So please share this out, because I will bring them in. Since they don't want to have a dialogue, an open dialogue, I will bring them in. So please tweet it out, share it out. I will definitely bring them on here live, on the feed live. I won't chat back and forth. I will bring them on the feed live. Live. We'll wait for a minute, Bruce. They are taking people's property ungodly. They are violating people's rights every day. They don't want it with me, but I'm going to put it out there. I will bring any judge, any attorney, any police officer, and I know y'all know some, so please share that with them. Don't get mad at me because we'll sit up here and argue with each other. We will sit up here and argue and debate with one another behind some stupid bull that have nothing to do with anything. I don't care about your religion, people. I don't care about your religion. You keep your religion in the clouds with you and your God. Our people's property are being taken. Brothers are being locked up behind stuff that's not even crimes. We are having these bogus debates on no kind of critical thinking, analytical thinking. Come on, people. So go share this with any attorney. Does it matter what country they're from? I don't give a damn what country you're from. I'm a jurist. J-U-R-I-S-T. Let me spell this one more time. J-U-R-I-S-T. A jurist is one who is versed and skilled in law. Now I'm gonna quote this and I'm gonna show y'all this. I don't care to get off of here then. It's everybody's always new. It's all, every, what you get in no here is not gonna be on my Patreon. So it doesn't matter, brother. It's every time I'm on this feed, it's always new people. So if it's, bo if it's boring to you, then you can leave. The problem is, y'all not getting it out there. This is the problem. It's always new people. My brother Harthorn James said to me, Sabir, you can never be a teacher like that because what happens is always new people on these threads. Every day, brother Daniel, is someone new. And I guarantee you, what I'm talking about is not always the same, brother. To you it may be. But it's not always the same. It's redundant when you hear that stuff in the classroom. It's redundant when y'all watch football every Sunday. It's redundant because you know every Sunday you want to sit and watch the same football game. As if it's something new. 
it's redundant when you know Christmas is a bunch of bull, but you want to sit and do Christmas every year. That's redundant and gets boring. That gets boring. But I'm on here, and I'm waiting for one of them to bite. This is why I. This is why the Patreon is even set up. So it's redundant to you and boring. I can't help you, brother. Until something happens to you. What you're looking for is an answer right now. But what I'm going to share with you. If you want to, here you go. Go here. Yes, every day brings in something totally different. Exactly. He don't get it yet. This is, what they, this is why we are where we are now. He said, with all due respect. I don't know why they do that. That's redundant too, with all due respect. And just say it's boring. <laughs> with all due respect, but it's boring though, right? Until they get in trouble, then my, my inbox will get blown up. I'm gonna keep it real with y'all. When, when they get, listen, when they get in trouble, my inbox will blow up. I have to have two questions up here. Just two questions, just two questions up here. Two questions leads into more questions. This is why I say, you can do a consultation with me. That's what happens with these guys. Cause you're looking for something on here for free from me. So, I know a lot about international law. Juris, I just told you what it was. Juris is one who is versed or skilled in law. One is versed and skilled in law. Answer to the last word, juris. So let me go over here. They don't even get it, John. I don't know who they think they be talking to, honestly. I have a whole bunch of new people on here. So let me show you what juris is. A legal scholar, one is versed in law, particularly civil law or laws of nations. So if you've been following me, you would understand what's going on. I didn't say you hate, I don't even, I would never say you hate, brother. I don't even use the word hate in my vocabulary. Hate is a horrible word. I don't even hate the brother that shot me up. But we hate our brothers every day. We hate our brothers every single day. But you don't hate the, the cops that shoot your brothers up. You don't hate him, because y'all not really, to re really willing to fight. George Prudence is a science of law, or the study of structures of legal system, i.e. distinguished from what? Content of the system of law. But we not mad at, we not mad at the, we not mad at the cop that shoot our brothers down in the street every day, or the attorney that lies to you and tell you to give them ten thousand dollars, and then you go to court, and you still lose money. But we will sit on social media and debate and argue with people. I'm 52, less learned men. No, you all right, Kev? Age has age has nothing to do with it, though, brother. You are good. Real talk, real, exactly, real talk, real action. You have to have action. So why is it? If, let me, let me make a promise to y'all. Can I make a promise to y'all? If I find 10 attorneys that would challenge me right now on any given day, I'll stop repeating myself then if that's the case. If, peace, peace. If you can find 10, five, let's say five, five attorneys, bring some police officers and mix them up in the pot too, in the judges. And then I'll stop. Okay? Is that, that sound good, y'all? Uh, did that sound good? That sound good? Don't get mad because I'm confident on what I'm saying. I'm confident that the attorneys and the police won't, they won't respond. That's all it is. They can't find one. They can't find one. So where's the other people out here? Hold up. Bear with me. I know, but this man said you're born. Listen, he's born with himself. He's born with himself. Salam, Rick. He's not born with me. He's born with himself. If anyone, if I'm bored, football bores me. I don't know if y'all know that or not. So I turn football off. Do y'all get that? Football is born to me. Basketball is born to me. I turn it off. Getting drunk every weekend, that could become boring. You do, do know, you do know that, right? Do you notice that? 
Do you know that drinking on the weekend, that we do that constantly? That's boring as hell to me. I don't like wasting money like that. I can't sit and watch sports for four hours because that's boring to me. That's very boring. Because they busy, they busy healing their own oath membership. Thank you. No doubt, brother. No doubt, brother Kev. I just want some attorneys to get on here. So bear with me. I'm going to show y'all something. Bear with me. This is a great learning. People, please focus. I'm glad because I don't watch football. I don't watch football or basketball. They know how to suck a Negroes in a heartbeat. Hey, is a basketball game on? Hey, Thanksgiving is around. Let's go watch football right after we eat and kill ourselves. Okay? It will never happen because you will expose the fraud. Oh, yes, I will expose the fraud. So listen, let me show y'all something. Bear with me. There's a state constitution, people. This is the constitution. Hold on, let me see which one this is. Yeah, where we at? Uh, let me find this real quick. Give me a second. I'm gonna show y'all something. They get Negroes in this season. So, here's a state constitution. Let me pull up the state constitution in Colorado. Listen, did y'all know it was a state constitution and the US constitution? Did y'all know that? Do you know that they take an oath on a state constitution and the US constitution, did y'all know that? This is Colorado kind. While all these politicians that we have, or all these radio shows, have they ever showed y'all the constitution of this and the constitution of this? Two of them. And both of these constitutions, they are in total violation of. Oh, you didn't know that? Oh yeah, brother, you got punching your state constitution. Do you know your state legislator is supposed to be giving these? These books are supposed to be free when you go to the state city city council's office. Did you know that? Oh, I've been, I already went deep, Dave. But if you want me to go deeper, y'all can sign up for Patreon because I'm going to have classes on here. I'm going to have classes on it. So if you can go to YouTube and punch in my name on YouTube, I believe I went deep. Okay, I went deep on many videos, but y'all don't appreciate it because I'm not selling it to y'all. I'm not selling it, so you don't appreciate it. So, I didn't went deep on many occasions on this. I didn't challenge them. I told y'all right now, I want y'all to share this out to a judge, police officer, and a politician. I want you to send this to them because I'm not a politician. I don't have to take an oath or nothing, nothing. But the one that you pay your tax dollars to is the one that's violating your rights every day. How could you take somebody's property without due process? Talk to me for a minute. How could you take someone's property without due process? Y'all should really look into a law dictionary to find out. Y'all should really look, find out why. So let's go over here to the Constitution then. No, do I have my Bill of Rights? Oh, I don't know if I brought my Bill of Rights with me, y'all. So bear with me one second. So bear with me. Let me see if I can find my Bill of Rights. <coughs> I think I brought it with me, y'all. Well, I can quote it. I can quote it. It says, in the, listen, the Declaration of Independence, it says, government was instituted amongst men, deriving their just power from the consent of the governed, that when any form of government becomes destructive to its ends, it is the right of the people to alter it, abolish it, and institute another one. 
Are you rocking me? Listen to me. The Declaration of Independence. It says, government, government, government was instituted amongst men, deriving their just power from the consent of the governed. That when any federal, state, local government become destructive to its ends, it is the right of the people to alter it, abolish it, and institute a new one. Now, please go look it up and tell me if I'm wrong or right. Go look it up and tell me if I'm wrong or right. And then ask yourself the question, how could they take people's property without due process? Out there for All right? So we love to argue and debate against each other, but we won't argue and debate with the ones that's duking you every single day. But you know what you'll say? No justice, no peace, no justice, no peace. But listen to me, sister. How could a little boy and little girl give consent? How can a minor give consent? How many of these grown folks that you know, sis, they're running around and calling themselves minorities? Minority has nothing to do with a number of people. The minority is talking about a mindset of a child. Do you understand that? This, again, hold on, let me do this. This is based on critical thinking again. Thinking for yourself and having critical thinking skills. But we can tell you everything about a basketball and a football game, but we can't tell you nothing about the laws. But we'll say, well, let's go to the judge or the attorney. So how could we possibly be talking about we are a minority of people? How could we talk about we are the minority of people, we're the majority? I've learned a lifetime this week exactly, and I am no minority. Thank you, my sister. We are never no minority. We're not. So how is it that we can have these grown folks calling our people minorities on national TV? You know how stupid we look? Oh, my bad. We shoot ourselves in the foot. If I, I shoot myself in the foot by telling you the truth. Do this sound like hate? Do this sound like any kind of hate? Or oh, I just want to challenge these attorneys. That's, people get mad at me because I say that. People get mad because I say, let's challenge these attorneys. Why well, get mad? Y'all the ones that go vote, so you can't get mad if something don't go right. You see how that works? You can't get mad if a politician don't do what they supposed to do when you supposed to know. <laughs> see how that is? You can't get mad at them. Get mad at yourself because you're supposed to have known this. You're supposed to have critical thinking. You're supposed to have critical thinking. I hate nobody at all. So don't never let nobody hate tell you that Sabir Bay hates. I hates nobody. We supposed to stand on principles. Love, truth, peace, freedom, and justice. Not a religion. Principles and morals. Okay? So how in the hell could we call ourselves a scholar and I'm a professor and I have five degrees in psychology. I have five degrees in whatever. No. No, people. Have critical thinking skills. Know how to comprehend things. Know how to analyze, scrutinize. We'll sit back and argue with one another about dogma and ancient black gods and black is not even an a dark, hold up, hold up. Let me show you this before I go. This water. Let me show y'all something. You would say this water is black, but if you look at it, it's brown. You see that? This is the craziness, man. See this? This is brown, but you say black. See that? We would say that's black, but it's brown. This scream is black. We even have people running around calling themselves this and don't even look like that. Think about the madness. Think about the madness. I don't know what the pH is in here, but Negroes get to get their pH together. <laughs> they, better, they better get their pH together. They don't even have theirs together. But no, dude, we the ancient black gods of Egypt. We the ancient black gods of Egypt. 
but go out and vote. Matter of fact, I'm gonna distract you with the football game now. I'm gonna distract you also with the basketball season coming around. March Madness. We out to lunch, baby. <laughs> we out to lunch. We have no critical thinking skills. None whatsoever. None whatsoever. None whatsoever. Yeah, this book is black with gold letters. He said, these definitions are define us. Yeah, look at that. You, oh, brother, be more. They better start getting some critical thinking skills down, Pat. But let me show you this in the Constitution that everybody runs to. So look, let me show you this. Hold up. Bear with me one second, y'all. So just in case we don't get into the Constitution. This is the 14th Amendment. Hold up. Where's the 14th? No, the 5th. Let's go to the 5th. Nor deprive of life, liberty, or property without due process of law, nor shall private property be taken for public use without just compensation. I want y'all to see this. Ask the, where's the attorneys at, y'all? Y'all sharing this out to the attorneys? Please share this out. Artez, I know you know some attorneys, brother. If any attorney comes on this thread, tell them that I'll bring them into the feed. You can bring in Malik Zulu Shabazz. I hope y'all share this to Malik Zulu Shabazz. Malik Zulu Shabazz. If you know who he is, share this video with him. Malik Zulu Shabazz. I don't hate my brother, but I would love to hear his point of view. So share this with him. Michael Cord. C O A R D. Share this with them. Whatever attorney you know, I will love to bring them in here. But if they want me to come somewhere, they have to put up that money to make that happen. It's just compensation. Well, we're going to get into that in a minute, Dexter. Don't worry about it. We're going to get into that. I told y'all, this is current. If you want full classes, you can sign up for my Patreon. So, that's the 5th. This is the 14th. Without due process of law, nor deny any person within the jurisdiction the equal protections. What's missing in here, people? What's missing in the 14th Amendment? Let me go back. The fifth. Y'all should have a constitution. But y'all see, we'll pay for emotional talk. We'll pay for emotional talk, but no real talk. What's missing, y'all? In the 14th Amendment. There's no mistakes in, in this, man. Come on, man. We got 42 people on here already, probably more. What's missing in the due process part? Thank you, my sister. We got 40-something people are here. And my sister Felicia caught it. Compensation. The Fifth Amendment says you can't take nobody's property without compensating. So let me ask y'all a question. Let's ask the attorneys on here and the judges on here. Are they compensating people for taking their property? Give me one minute. Are they compensating people? I'll wait. Just in case y'all don't know what that is, let me see. They so smart though, right? They're smart. They brilliant. I went to Spelman and I went to Harvard, I went to Yale, but yet you're voting for these people, right? Let me take you to law real quick. That's compensation. You see that? 
So if you take somebody's property, so obviously you don't own your property. You see that? Represent by con, con what? Just compensation. So they say see just compensation. So if it's your property, so let me ask y'all a question. Let's go back to that RICO law again. Let's go back to the RICO law. Is this making sense, y'all? Is this making any kind of sense? Is it making any kind of sense? So you don't hear me talk about the same thing every day. So I fill the audience out first and foremost. And I'm talking to the attorneys that's on here because I know they're watching. I know y'all watching. I know you police officers watching. You's too punctified to say anything. They're just too punctified to say something because the jig is up. We are in the information age, people. Yes, they can say, well, you can talk all that tough talk on here. Listen, let me take one cop with five brothers. Why do you think it take five cops to take down one dude? Why do you think it takes five cops to take down one dude or 10 cops? Let's reverse the table. Let's have five brothers with one cop. What do you think they would do? See, y'all don't get it yet. We'll argue with each other. We'll argue with each other, but you mean reverse, reverse the tables. Five brothers with one cop. I bet you any amount of money that cop be begging for his damn life. I bet. Begging for his life. Oh no, brother, I'm just working, brother. It's just my job. That's what, this is what niggas, this is what the cops are saying. It's just my job. It's just my job. I have to do my job. What is your job? I'm asking police officers now. What is your job? What's your job? Yeah, please don't hurt me. I got family. But you can shoot a brother up a thousand times. And Negroes will get on social media and on radio and TV talking about police brutality. You can shoot a brother with five to 10 cops. Listen to me, I want y'all to get this. With five to 10 cops, you wanna still use a gun and shoot somebody? Really? If they ain't a punk, I don't know what the hell you call that. No, they're not there to protect the sir. That's the problem. Do you know that the police have no right to protect? Did y'all know that in law? The police don't have no, you better study some laws. The police is to protect the property. This is why you will see everything is about revenue with these people. Everything is about revenue with these people. Everything is about revenue. Make that clear. This is why you see them walk in stores and sign the log sheets. Now, police officers, tell me if I'm wrong or right. Yes, they, oh, we're going we're gonna to walk right into that in a minute, Jermaine. We're going to walk right into that. That's why they sign the log sheets, baby. They don't work for you. If that's the case, every cop will be locked up, not sitting behind desk duty. Not behind desk duty, they'll be locked the hell up. Okay? Yeah, they protected their masses, but I'm gonna show y'all something that none of your black politicians show you. So bear with me one second. Am I rubbing somebody the wrong way yet? This is Title 18. Cornell Law. Title 18, United States Codes. That's what that stands for. Right? Title 18, terrorism. Title 18. The term domestic terrorism means activities that what? Involve acts dangerous to human life. It didn't say civil rights, did it? Acts to human life is a violation of what? The criminal law of the United States. So tell me, y'all, why you let these black people get on TV and radio and talk crazy to y'all? I told y'all the shit is the Malik Zulu Shabazz. Or any attorney. I need to, for them to explain this. I need them to explain this. To intimidate or coerce a civilian population. 
to influence, even when they threaten you. To, if you don't sign a subpoena or a citation, we're going to lock you up. Tell me if that's not, hold up, y'all. Tell me if that's not a threat. That's terrorism, right? But you was hit up here and allowed them to say it's the law. Be fly. I hope you share this out. This is this is Title 18, United States. You can Google that and look it up. This is in the United States Code. This is United States Code. So we should be on every social media beating them up about this. Not brutality. Brutality does not exist in law, people. You can't find brutality in no law dictionary. None whatsoever. So how are we going to fix it? I'm not in that position because they keep Sabir Bay away. And I don't even talk hate, but they keep me away because I know their BS. I can catch their bull. In their eyes, we're not human. But the problem is you have the Declaration of Human Rights. Look up the Declaration of Human Rights, not civil rights. So let's take you to the law dictionary to look up some words. You don't have to be subject to anybody's rules, people. You don't have to be subject to nobody's rules. The solution is I'm giving it to you right now. The solution is right now I'm giving it to you. Y'all asking for the solution. The solution is right here. It's right here. I just quoted the Declaration of Independence. It says anytime any government become destructive to its ends, it is the right of the people to alter it, abolish it, and institute a new one. Solutions. Put money up. Back real people. Get them where they need to be. To speak for you. Y'all asking me when I'm not the politician. But get me the revolution that I can't even spell at. Because Negroes is not even mentally equipped. They're not physically equipped. Nor do they have arms. Let me say this one more time. They're not mentally. Because as soon as you throw some money out. I've been in this game for a long time. I never bought. But I never bit that apple. Never bit that apple. If you throw some money against one of these Negroes that's on social media, they'll say, yeah, well, let's go against him. Well, let's expose him. Let's talk about him. Yo, how much? well, he did this. You have to mentally be prepared to not to give a F. Not to give a F. Are you following me? That's what you got to do. Prepare this. In the physical, these Negroes are not prepared. They're overweight. They have GMO bodies. They drinking on the weekend, watching football. You just got done eating Thanksgiving dinner. High off a trip to Phoenix, and sit on the couch and watch the football game. Really? So you're not physically fit, mentally fit, nor do you have arms. Nor do you have the arms. Think about it. Think about what I said. The ones that you keep getting locked up that you call gangbangers is the ones that we need to get to. Let's get to the guys that's on the streets. But y'all don't want to hear that though Y'all don't want the guys on the street That don't give a damn That's all they need is the focus The brothers on the street only needs the focus That's all they need They need real people to talk to them I'm from the streets of South Philly baby The best business people Are on the street Let me say this one more time The best business people are on the streets To be a chemist you gotta, To cook cocaine You gotta be a chemist to cook coke, you gotta be a chemist, so we can cook anything. To be a businessman, a negotiator, on the street, know how to negotiate that deal, baby. We we have it. To listen, to count money, you gotta know how to count, baby. You know how to count. My boy died, 24 years old. He didn't even know how to count at all, but he was counting hundreds of thousands of dollars. That's an account. So think about it. Y'all looking in the eyes of the European way. Oh, yeah, you got to go to Harvard and Spelman and Yale to be an accountant. You got to go to Spelman and Harvard and Yale to be a, um, a spokesperson. Nah, I didn't go to school for radio. I didn't go to school for radio. If you put me in any radio station, I did it for 17 years. 17 years on radio. Five different radio stations. In every radio station I went to, I killed it. I produced... I hosted, I engineered my radio show. One more time. And it's in every last one of us. I engineered, 
hosted and produced my radio show and do damn good. 17 years in it, five different radio stations. Think about what I'm saying to y'all. The best business people are on the street. Stop looking towards someone's, I have to go to college. No, put your degree, your agree up against their degree. One more time. Pit your agree, which means to achieve, up against their degree. And degree means to take away from. Defrost, derail, denounce. Stop allowing these people to put this bull in your head. Please look up the prefix for degree. Please look it up. Get familiar with a dictionary. The prefix for degree is DE. Defrost, derail, denounce. Take away from. If I'm wrong, if you're a professor, if you're a person that's in college and think that I'm wrong, then I'll bring you on here too. I would definitely bring you on the feed live. No doubt. Now, they don't hear me, brother, but I definitely will bring them on here. You think I've been on here for a minute? You think they're not watching? Because I want all the 50 people or 51, 52 people that's on here, probably more. I want y'all to share this out. It's getting, listen, people, it's getting tiresome. It's really getting tiresome to constantly keep beating this in people's heads. Let this go out the same way we promote the black, the white supremacy, the black gods of Egypt. Let's let, let this go out the exact same way we push out white supremacy, white supremacy, white supremacy. Let's promote this out. Let's put it out there, same way. So, I want you to go, I want to go back to this real quick. Domestic terrorism. Get that in your mental roller deck that it's not brutality, people. It's not brutality. I want you to see this to intimidate a coercive civilian population. So this is what you do. You go look that word up. In a law dictionary, because brutality don't exist in law. It's, it's very tiresome. Because it seems like it falls on deaf ears. There you go, right there. See that word that I just showed you? Coerce. Coerce. All this is in here. To compel, which the 13th Amendment talks about that. You can't be compelled to be a witness against yourself induces a person to act otherwise than freely. Tell me if this is not what's happening. You're not free to go? Really? Coercion? Really? So when a the cop tell you they're gonna lock you up because you don't sign a site. I hope y'all get some police on here. So if a cop tell you they're going to lock you up if you don't sign a... I thought a signature, your signature is voluntarily. Don't ask me about going to no courtrooms. Tell them that let's do this on a national TV or any of these wannabe court TV shows. You can share this to Judge Joe Brown. You can share this to any of these judges, these fake TV judges too. Judge Mathis, any of them. Tell them let's have an open dialogue. Again, shit is the Malik Zulu Shabazz too, y'all. Or anybody that's an attorney. This is what's going on. Duress. So I want to walk y'all through to show y'all what's going on, people. This is crazy, yo. Duress. Compels another to do what he would not otherwise do. Tell me if this is not what's happening. I don't care which one, pick any of them. I know, sister, listen, I live in LA. I know the court TVs. <laughs> listen, I know the court TVs. Y'all thinking 
<laughs> that these people are real judges. No, they're actors. Let me share this with y'all. In Philadelphia, where I was born and raised at, I think they switched it up. To be, let me, let me, I'm, I'm, I'm walk y'all through this. Bear with me for a minute. To be a minor judiciary judge, you have to study Title 18, Title 42, Title 75. One is motor vehicle, one is crime and criminal procedure, okay? It's small. You're not dealing with constitutional judges. You're not dealing with constitutional laws. You're being duped by people who has been programmed to actually regurgitate the bull. So let me take y'all some critical thinking again. Are, are everybody's okay? Is everybody good? Give me one minute. I'm gonna take you back to critical thinking. Oh boy. It's a joke. Oh, it's a joke because what happened? I'm going to train you 12 years of brainwashing camp in college. Y'all think these people are smart because they went to college. I told you the best, the best business people on the streets. We straight hustlers. What they do is they punctify you when you go to college. They make you a little wuss. Just do my bidding. What do you want, a white picket fence? You want a nice car? You want to go somewhere where some Negroes don't go? Bear with me. Let me flip this around to the 8th grade civics book. My sister keeps saying, sign up for Patreon, y'all. Thinking for yourself. Hold up. Where's my book at? This is the 8th grade civics book. Thinking for yourself. Thinking for yourself, 8th grade civics book. Our republic can only work can work only if the citizens are willing to think for themselves and simply not accept what others tell them. Ooh. Are we really thinking for ourselves? Or are we going along to get along? So why do we keep blaming the cracker, the white man? When you got black people, this is the book. That's the book. Eighth grade civics book. So why is it that we keep blaming the, the white man? when it's black folks that swear they have a degree in something, or they smart. I have masters. I have a masters in this. I have a PhD in stupidity. Think about it. But turn around and call America a country. This book is a good book to get. The indoctrination, yeah, the indoctrination is a mother freaking. It's convenient. Listen, in the federal prison, they say never get, listen, in the federal prison, they say never get comfortable. They don't let you get comfortable in the federal prisons, people. They move you from place to place to place to place. The problem is with Negroes, we are too comfortable. Until something happens, then they want to kill their whole family, jump off a bridge, or rob, steal, kill, and lie, or even sell their bodies. Most sell their bodies. Because once this thing crumbles, once it crumbled, because why? You could not see that you was being deceived. Remember what I told you about that movie, y'all? 12 Years a Slave. Remember that movie? Remember when I told you about the movie in 12 Years a Slave? When he said he was deceived? Remember when he woke up as a slave? And go watch the 12 Years a Slave when he talked about it. I was deceived. They got me drunk. They got me drunk in a mud rig. Niggas are drunk off these degrees. They are drunk off these degrees. And they think they better than somebody else. Ah, oh, brother, I went to Spelman Yale, but I have something over you. No, baby. No. My ancestors, the Moors, educated the world. My ancestors, the Moors, educated the world. Did you catch that? My ancestors, the Moors, not religion, the Moors educated the world. I was in Spain, I saw the university that the Europeans set their children at the feet of your ancestors. Now Negroes have been hit in their head, knocked unconscious, running around telling them I'm African American and black. 
but yet, yet, this is what they do. Look, donate now. Human Rights Watch. Marinate on that for a second. <clears throat> Marinate on that. Why black leaders are talking about civil rights? Talk to me for a minute. And they're asking for 50 to 100 to 250 to 500 to $1,000 or others to the Human Rights Watch why Negroes are talking about civil rights and I just showed you. I just showed you what they're doing to you. But we don't have black leaders standing up for this. It's a domestic terrorism activities that what? Acts involve acts that are dangerous to human life, not civil rights. Human life. Domestic terrorism, people. But yet they want you to donate to this. 50 to 100 to 500 to a thousand dollars really and what are they giving you what are these black leaders giving you when they come on Sundays and lie to you in the church civil rights are civil no it's not civil rights is only from discrimination civil rights is only brother Bruce could you look that up civil rights is from discrimination and we discriminate every day we discriminate every day. Every day. I hope y'all go support, because I've been on here. I said I wasn't going to be on here this long. But I hope y'all go to Cash App and support, or you can go sign up for Patreon too. Nothing. You get nothing from them. Nothing from them. But every time you turn on a football game, basketball, you know they got this 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 rating. This rating to actually get paid off of y'all turning it on. Arbitron. Did y'all know that? This is what the civil rights is under. Yup, Nielsen, Arbitron, all of it. Every time you go on there. So this is what is under. Civil rights is under this. It's only from discrimination, people. Hold up. All this is civil rights. Oh, what did that say? Deparations of rights under the color of law? This is all it is, people. We all discriminate some kind of way. We discriminate what we're going to put on. We discriminate what woman we're going to talk to. We discriminate against everything. So it ain't human rights violations. Let's go back to that. Let's go back to the human rights. Let me see if I still got it up here. <laughs> it ain't against human rights. Think about it. So that's why they can kill a nigga in the street and get away with it. You don't see nobody getting killed in the street from synagogue. They darker than me. From Somalia, Sudan, Nigeria, Nowhere. But I know y'all afraid to tell the truth. I know. I got that part. I understand, people. I know y'all afraid. I know. But you need to take this and look at that again. You see that? Eight rules. Clean. Both inside and out of you. But what I love is to be brave. Right? Be too brave to lie. But let's go to Will Smith's. Live life without fear. Y'all not getting this, man. This is so simple. And don't forget, let me pop back over to the calendar again. This is my calendar. It don't say Spain, it's Andalusia. I took this photo looking over to the Alhambra. So cop your calendar, people. It's like a collector's item. Please cop this. Ooh. That's me taking my, that's my photos. I've been, this is not Photoshop. Noble Drew Ali, solar return. Picture that. 
Ivan Van Sertimize. Really? Martin Luther. Ooh. These are all my photos. I have over 300. I'm working on a book right now, too. A photo book. So we need to support people. Y'all can support the lying attorneys that rip you off every day. And I've been on here for a while. You know they didn't, they didn't get on here yet. That's the Al the Alcazar that was built before the Alhambra. This is the Alhambra. Oh sister, I got I got more calendars, sis. So you can get the calendar. We are I'm still out here in Denver. This is, that's a Morris Fountain. Malcolm X Solar Return. This is put together hand. It wasn't by them. It was handmade, put together. Shout out to my sister Amahi. We actually put the dates of, we have more people names that we putting inside here too. Handmade. Put the work in. Okay, that's an orange inside the Alhambra. Alcazar Queen Mother Moore these are all my photos walking through Spain and again I have over 300 so every time I'm on this live feed sometimes people ask me do people support I say hell no they really don't they really don't but I don't care that's why you don't get that much from me Marcus Garvey, baby. I guess I got a lot of people. The Mosquito. You see the SWAT? See that? This is in a Jewish area. See that? This was built in the 7th century. This is the Mosquito built in the 7th century. The Alhambra. I took pictures from this angle up here and from this part. Elijah Muhammad Solar Return. Ooh. Dick Gregory. Sabi. Dr. Ben. So people, here you go. That's the Patreon. You can become a member. In-depth classes will be on Patreon. So hopefully when I get this thing together in Denver, hopefully I did my first Spain lecture tour out here in Denver. I'm waiting for the DVD to get finished. You can email us, because we can email the file to y'all. You got to pay for it first, but I'm waiting for my brother Jeff to get back with me. The lecture tour I did started out here in Denver. Okay? No, it's not on the website yet. Just go to requestinfo at thesabirabayshow.com. Please don't ask me things that you can go to requestinfo at thesabirabayshow.com and just get it done. Islam, sister. I'm a, it's constantly working. Cash app is here. PayPal is there. Please don't be redundant with the stuff, y'all. When people say ask me these questions, they I don't never see these people who ask me these questions go and do what I just said do. It is not hard to reach me. It is not hard at all. So stop asking. Hit the request info at the severe bay the severe bay show.com. It is that simple. For any kind of booking, consultations, anything, it's just right there. The first master class is going to be, hopefully, out here as soon as my brother Jeff gets back with me. Okay? If you want the lecture tour in your city, your town, or when I get there, I will be there. So I put this out here for these attorneys. Y'all see the attorneys? I put up the attorneys, police officers, 
in judges. Not one yet jumped on here. So I want all of y'all to do me a favor. I want all y'all to do me a favor. Yes, we probably charge ten dollars to come in here, sister. Ten or fifteen dollars to come into the master class because it's not going to be live on YouTube. It's not going to be live on Facebook. It's only going to be live on Patreon. So if you're not signed up to Patreon, you will not see it live. You will not see it live. So you have to look for Patreon and sign up. Or y'all can go right now to Cash App. And donate. Hold on, let's find that flyer. Let's find this again. Hold on, let me see this again. Hold up. I'm crazy though, right? But they just asked for, hold up. I just gave y'all a whole class just now. Did I, did I not? Hold up. Let's do this. Let's do this. Look, can someone send me 50? Can y'all send me 100 or 250? Look at this, what they asking for. And I actually started to donate to this. I'm so serious. I started to donate to this. I really started to. Because I was digging what they were saying in here. Look. 100% of the donations have helped to defend human rights. I said, yo. You don't see that? So 50, 100. Can I? Can we do a challenge like my sister Jazz said? Let's do a challenge on here, people. Challenge $50 to $100. That's a challenge. Let's do that $50 to $100 to $250, $250 challenge. Watch how many people jump off this mother freaking. They're going to jump off. They're going to jump off real quick. But this is what Europeans do. Because they support and they don't understand what's going on. I just sat here and read from you from the Constitution. Art of Deception. A law dictionary. Right? Sure don't say five dollars. It is it, 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 damn sure ain't they're not saying five why would they say five dollars on here? They're not talking five dollars. Why would the Europeans say five dollars? They shoot they ain't playing. Cause you know why? They value this information. They value. And this, just like these cats that want to debate with me, my sister Jazz told them to put up $5,000. If you are concrete on what you think or what you believe, you will put up that money with no doubt. You will put that money up with no doubt. So don't try to bring Sabir Bay's name in and talk about you want to have a debate with me where not one judge, not one police officer, not one attorney ever challenged me. But you YouTubers and you Facebookers always got to bring Sabir Bay's name and just put up the money or shut up. And then I think about it. If it's a $5,000, I definitely would think about it. But Europeans will put up money because they understand the outcome. They understand the outcome of what's going on. I just told y'all that there is no law called brutality. There is no law called brutality. There is no law or no such thing as police brutality nor white supremacy. There is no such thing as white supremacy. It's inferiority, not white supremacy. So I need all of y'all on this thread to share this out. Pull it, rip it, put it on Facebook, YouTube, Whatever you want. Let's get down to business, man. And please support. Please support. 2500 up front. They're not trying. I wish somebody would put up 2500 up front. I'll jump on the next plane smoking. Not even being prepared. You hear that? The next thing smoking without even being prepared. I will come straight with this. What I got now. I'm sitting in a coffee shop. This is straight how I believe. Think about it. You think they're not listening? They are. So y'all don't really want this because you know why? They'll throw a football game. They'll throw somebody else to talk about white supremacy. And y'all fall right back to sleep again and turn around and say, 
no justice, no peace. When do we want it? We want it now. When do we need it? We need it now. We out to lunch, man. So listen, I think I almost covered everything. I believe I covered everything. It's time for me to eat. I gotta eat. So, parking authority are privately owned institutions. Police departments or organizations. Get them under the RICO law. Stop allowing these so-called black attorneys to lie to you. Stop allowing these black attorneys. If you know any black attorney, please share this with them. Let me give them my email. Request info at the Show.com. Request info at the Show.com. And if they want my private one, I can give that private one too. Sabir Bay Radio at gmail.com. Sabir Bay Radio at gmail.com. Just in case, we're going to give it to them all. Facebook is all there. So let's have this open dialogue and support people. If the European is supporting, like Noble Drew Ali said, if the European is helping me, why not you? Why not you? Stop allowing these people to bicker back and forth with one another about the ancient black gods. And ancient black, black is not an ancient word. Or any kind of religious dogma. Okay? So please share this out and please support. I say it again, please support. And become a member also. Peace.